John Walsh has to have a big game tonight. In the last ball game against Utah State, he threw for 619 yards. They still lost the ball game. Their running game is last in the whack, so John Walsh has to have a game tonight where he controls the line of scrimmage with short passes, keeps Marshall Falk and San Diego State offense off the field. Eric Drage is BYU's leading receiver, 50 receptions, four touchdowns, but he's got five broken ribs. He will be sidelined for San Diego State. Their speed burner, Darnay Scott, who leads the Aztecs with 62 receptions, 10 touchdowns. He, too, will be in street clothes. Now Looks left the whole way, dropped the ball. The scramble's on, and BYU with a chance to cover it, do they? I believe so, at about the 11-yard line. Ball game should be a turnover. is just critical because you allow the other team's offensive football team to play on a short field. Travis Hall, number 56, caused this turnover. Balls from the shotgun. Plenty of time to the end zone, wide open, touchdown BYU, and it is Micah Matsuzaki. He's going to run a post here, and he just, it's the ability to clear out. You see how tight all three receivers are, a busted coverage and man coverage. Daryl Lewis, number nine. Play fake to Falk. Gutierrez going deep, man out there, and he's got it. 619 yards, and you lose a football game. You're giving up some big plays defensively, and you see rush defense, they're 103rd in the NCAA pass efficiency defense, 92nd total defense, 103rd, 104th in scoring. Williams to the bottom of your screen. And Gutierrez throws the fade over in the corner. Touchdown, Maxwell. Over the middle. And it's Chad Lewis, the tight end, who picks up nine. And all the way out to the 44-yard line already. And a big opening. And to midfield goes Jamal Willis. Days ago, the loss to Utah State. On third and ten. Walsh wide open across the middle. First down to the 38. And it's Bryce Doman. Pat Fried and Rick Walker with you from Jack Murphy Stadium. First down for the home team, the Aztecs and Marshall Falk in a whole bunch of trouble. And he's going to lose about... Here they come. Gutierrez goes down. Grant at their own 44-yard line. Tyler Anderson, number four, is the big play receiver for BYU. Across the middle on the gallop, Nowatsky. Nowatsky all the way to the 24-yard line. That family. First down, Cougars from the shotgun. They'll keep it on the ground. Jamal Willis with a flag down, and Willis storms his way to the eight-yard line. But again, a penalty marker down from what the snap count is. <laughs> Here comes a full blitz on first down. Walsh got it away. Touchdown! Nowatsky. Two to seven. John Walsh, who's six foot four, and that helps him in this situation. 210 pounds. He's hit by Sean Smith, but is still able to get the football off to Tim Nowatsky for the touchdown. The sprint draw to Falk, and boy, read beautifully by. So far, BYU doing what Mike talked about, forcing San Diego State to throw. That's a great job. 106 left first quarter. And it's 13-7 BYU. And Walsh set to put it up again and fires it out complete. Just a little hitch to Tyler Anderson, a guy that Mike Godfrey pointed out earlier. He yielded it for one. And San Diego State had a field day, or an air day, I should say, against the Gophers. Falk fumbles. I think Hall has covered it for BYU. I think go downtown to Tyler Anderson on the first play. They might. Walsh has hit five different receivers already. They're going to try and end around here, Anderson. And he dropped the ball, looking for the handle, and he goes down on it way back at the 36-yard line. Any team can pick up 33 and 28. These guys can. Walsh finally throws. Complete, not a first down. They picked up a Dean seven with the ball at their own 13-yard line. Buck really covered it this time, but he finds an opening, and he rumbles. On first and ten, Gutierrez off play action, wants a home run ball deep for Williams. He's got it. And he's got it. 
three, though, with eight minutes, 49 seconds to go in the half. Some kind of receiver. Third and ten. Walsh looking for someone other than Graves. He's only going to find a big group. Gutierrez on the slant in, incomplete, intended for... And they will kick it. Nice high kick by Kaziki. And if he gets good coverage, and he does at the one-yard line. And there's the view that Willis has in the backfield. He gets the call, and he finds a little room out to the five-yard line for the Cougars. And Willis gets the first down. And across the field. And his past matchups with the Aztecs. As a runner again. Gets outside and out to the 24-yard line. Give him eight. No goal line. Off the side of his foot. Boardman had a couple of great kicks. Third down along six. Here comes a blitz. Gutierrez stands in. Lost one. Peterson's got it. One career rushing touchdown. Marshall Fogg has 52 career rushing touchdowns. Just have not been able to get the ball out of their own end zone this, this uh, quarter. Walsh from the spread here in the final half minute of the first half. Man open and out of bounds after he crosses midfield. A couple of timeouts left. Walsh in trouble. Steps up. Whoa, what a hit. Bryce left before intermission. Play fake. Walsh rolls for the first time tonight. He'll run for the first down and better get down and get a timeout. He got out of bounds. And he's got it right through the middle. Town lead. San Diego State at home in this whack battle has a one-point lead on the Cougars of BYU. The second half. Tyler Anderson, well, maybe that gives you an answer, but he picks it up and reverses his field, and he's got tremendous speed, sprinter speed, a kicker to beat. Anderson down the sideline. San Diego State 47-yard line. Aztecs thinking about a blitz. They back off of that. And Walsh throws the deep up and gets it to Matsuzaki. A little bit better chance to throw the football. They'll look at it again, second and 12. Tremendous catch at the six-yard. Dolman, the wide outs on second and goal. They play fake, and Walsh does roll and throws. Touchdown! Two receivers to the bottom of your screen, and a third one in motion that way, but they're going to go to Hamuli the other way. He's in. Put the ball on the left hash mark, put three wide receivers to the right side, and went back into the short side for the two-point play. Two yards and a first down at the 48-yard line. They play fake it to Falk. Man wide open. Peterson's got it inside the 20. Out of that backfield, though. And the play action to Falk. The throw to the end zone. Touchdown! At 24. And wide receiver candidate not playing tonight due to a bad back. Third and ten. Walsh, man open, got him. Ten. He's had a big night. Willis on a counter. And he's got a for green as Tyler Anderson. That's Suzaki to the left. They're going to go the sweep to the left side. And Jamal Willis gets it inside the 20. And he missed it to the right. Time to have the ball. Marshall Falk is over 100 yards tonight, and he's into the secondary. And he is gone. Falk. Touchdown. 71 yards. Those numbers can get big, and I mean in a hurry, Mike. The adjustment by San Diego State to go to two tight ends, balance up BYU, and... Once he gets in the secondary, number 28, you can forget catching him. Of as big as Rick is, they may throw him in that offensive line. We've had five lead changes tonight. And Walsh goes to the air. 
Matt Suzaki made the catch, but he got 25 yard line. Over the middle, man wide open, first down. Flags go down late as Christensen takes it up. Offensive pass interference. Backs and what they've done tonight, both have been very efficient. And the key, no interceptions, although they've been some badly thrown football. Walsh off the roll. Dolman the other side. This one he's got at the 40-yard line. Second and 20. Waltz for Matsuzaki, he's got another one. First and goal, Cougars. Catch footballs. Michael Matsuzaki again, number 87, on a post route versus Michael Driver again. Look at him lay out. Backfield, now Nowoski in motion. And they'll keep it on the ground to Willis, almost untouched for the score. Now they load up the backfield for Falk, and Marshall cuts outside. There he goes again, down the sideline. Marshall Falk all the way to the 20. Over 200 yards, including tonight, where it's already up to 223 and two scores. <laughs> Gutierrez flush from the pocket. And he threw it right to the defensive back. Jack DeMooney. Nobody else there. I don't know what Gutierrez moved to come out. Kalen Hall bounces off one would-be tackler in the compact minute of the third quarter from Jack Murphy Stadium. Willis got a big opening left side, and he is off into the secondary. Lewis and Sutton have to track him down. He's up to 86 yards on the night. They fake the end around again, and Walsh wants to go deep. Man wide open is Christensen. Nobody home. Touchdown, BYU. He's going to come out of the backfield. Now, Norm Chow, again, a good call. He didn't give up on this play, even though it two times kind of backfired. Now you stop it. There is nobody. Darrell Lewis is the closest defender, but the only thing between Steve Christensen and that football is air because there's nobody else around this young man for the touch. Grab another beverage of your choice, another bag of chips. We've got the fourth quarter to go. Lead will change again, maybe, or at least the score will change again sometime in the next 15 minutes. You can be guaranteed of that. San Diego State on third and long to start the fourth quarter. Gutierrez over the middle, had it. Oh, third and ten. Walsh over the middle, caught. First down, Salaone, and he's in the San Diego State Territory. First down, BYU at the 47-yard line of the Aztecs. And Kalen Hall to the 40. Third down and three. Walsh got it away at the last second. Christensen got another one. Down the sideline, touchdown! 40 yards. Now, shotgun. Steve Christensen over the middle. There's the catch, but now again, poor tackling, poor pursuit. There's number 24, Kalen Hall with a key block to spring Steve Christensen for the touchdown. It's 45 to 31, 13.03 left. And left this season, the remaining games for these two teams. And you see the numbers on Walsh. Just another five touchdown night. He's not finished yet. Nope. A series of an injury, but uh, we're sending him over to the hospital to get some x-rays, and then we'll go from there. Okay, so now, usually a situation like that. Gutierrez in trouble, got away from it, completes it to Marshall Falk. His first catch of the night, we... Third and 24. Here comes the heat on Gutierrez, and down he goes. Flags down again at the... Even anything to get it across the 50, it might be two down territory. Got to throw the ball deep on this play. This is, has to be a deep throw for Tim Gutierrez. Play action, he rolls and fires it long. Not shot everybody. The Mooney back. Second down and seven, Kalen Hall into the secondary. 
and into San Diego State territory to the 26-yard line. First down at the 26-yard line of San Diego State. They give it to Kalen again. Cuts back again in another nice game. Broke about three tackles, and he's got 10 or 11 more. Ball game. Hall. Six or seven more before we're pretty much ice the ball game, but he missed it to the left. San Diego State, maybe now they've got a little 28 bit. left. They're down by two touchdowns. Over the middle. Oh, what a catch. First and 10, Aztecs. Gutierrez, pocket collapsing, goes down the middle again. Marshall Fox got it at the 29. He's got 285 yards of total offense. Gutierrez throws. Touchdown, Keith Williams. Concentration by the receiver. What a catch by Keith Williams, number 81. What a block by Marshall Falk. They're going to kick it. Tyler Anderson will backpedal. He's going to have to shag it down at the eight-yard line. And that worked out very well. BYU by a touchdown, but inside their own 15 with a second and seven. No one sitting in Jack Murphy Stadium right now. Walsh in trouble. Down he goes. Terod Smith left. Third down and ten. Walsh fires. It's intercepted. At the 15-yard line. To try to pick up the first down. But John Walsh did not get enough on this ball. He's looking over the middle. Now he comes off. Didn't get enough on the ball. Ball was played well by Sean Smith, number 99. To the right side for Gutierrez. He looks that way. Waits. Will take football the last three years. Do you try to get it to him? Gutierrez in trouble. Dropped the ball, picked it up, and he's dumped. And San Diego State does not get in. Now the two-point conversion. They're trying to go to Marshall Falk out of the backfield. Pressure again by Randy Brock, number 97. Tim Gutierrez just dropped the two ball. years ago because it was Ty Detmer who led BYU back to a 52-52 tie. That tie in the standings cost San Diego State the trip to the Holiday Bowl. With that in mind, knowing that a tie in this situation would not really help them, it's almost like a loss in the conference standings as they wind down the final three weeks. Al Luganville says, let's go, boys. Let's go for it. And they come up short. It goes to the left. A pretty good kick. Loose ball. Johnson saying BYU has it. Obviously, he's going to say that. And a mad pileup. And it is BYU's football. 417 yards and five touchdowns for John Walsh. And I don't think there's any doubt on the other side who it's going to be who put on a brilliant performance for San Diego State. They're All-American running back. Marshall Falk, 252 on the ground, a couple of touchdowns, but his team's going to come up one point shy tonight. <laughs> and Lavelle Edwards will not lose five in a row. The snap, the uh, losing skid snaps at four straight. And BYU may be on their way to another whack title. Wyoming will have something to say about that. But BYU wins this shootout at Jack Murphy Stadium, 45 to 44. For Mike Godfrey to Rick Walker and our entire ESPN crew, I'm Brad Nessler. Thanks for being with us from Jack Murphy Stadium. This has been a lot of fun. 45-44, BYU a winner.